Hi guys, it's reaction time. We got the band Last in Line and the song Do the Work. Something you have to do in life. You have to do do the work. That's what it's about. You have to do it, put a bit of work in if you want something out of this life. Don't sit on your fucking ass and wait for it all to come to you. You have to do some work. And yeah, that's my my little saying of the day, my little bit of advice. <laughs> anyway, done plenty of fucking work on this channel, I tell you. <laughs> Ridiculous. Anyway. Um, Do The Work is the second single from Last In Line from the forthcoming album, Jericho, out on March the 31st, I think it is. Yes, March the 31st. Um, there is 31 days in March, isn't there? <laughs> ah, perhaps I didn't do enough work in school. Perhaps that's what the problem is. Anyway, yes, March the 31st, it's out. Vamp's here, he likes this band. Anyway, um, Jericho is coming out on Ear Music. Um, it's the third album from Last in Lion. And in the band are some massive names. You've got Andrew Freeman on the vocals. What a great job he did on the last song. Was it Ghost Town? I think it was called, something like that. Um, he did a brilliant job on that last song. Um, you've got Phil. I always know, don't know how to pronounce his surname. Soisson. Is that French? Or Susan on the bass. Um, of course, you know, these guys are fucking mega stars in rock and metal. You know what I mean? Um... Vinnie Appice on the drums. Fucking love Vinnie Appice, man. And Vivian Campbell, of course, on the guitar. Vivian can be let loose again, hopefully. <laughs> the reins from Def Leppard are gone and he can fucking turn his guitar up. Here we go. Looking forward to this. Last in line, do the work. Here we go. Can't wait, guys. words a bit wrong there <laughs> i kind of get do the work wrong i came in a bit early anyway um fucking hell man it's great to hear vivian campbell 
<laughs> it's great to hear his guitar. It really fucking is. I mean, I love his playing. I really do. Although, this is probably simple stuff to him. You know, it's really groove laden, riffy, real stuck in that classic rock vein. You know, I mean, I mean the, the stuff he did with Vivian Campbell, obviously done with Dio, was more along the metal edge side, the metal side to it. This is more like, yeah, definitely classic rock, a little bit bluesy. You know what I mean? But it sounds fucking great. Um, fucking sound of this as well. I, I mentioned on a song earlier on that I did that the drums sounded great on the on the mix. They fucking sound brilliant on this, man. They sound fucking brilliant. The snare drum just is thumping, thumping, fucking thumping. Some of the great little touches that uh, Vinny Apice does as well, man. I just like, he, he's, he does these little sort of drum rolls the sort of half drum rolls and they sound really fucking cool. I don't know what it is about his drumming. I fucking love his drumming. Um, anyway, the the bass is just, I mean, so solid, man. Um, what an experienced and so fucking cool um, bass player Phil Susan is. <laughs> um, love it, man. Love, uh, I'm going to get along to the vocalist in a minute, but so the guitar, drums and bass are just fucking outstanding. And it's real got a fucking groove, a proper heavy groove to it. Straight away, I was like, do the work. It's like fucking, you just can't stop getting into it. I think it's a little bit more catchier as well than Ghost Town. I think that chorus is ultra catchy. I knew it was coming the second time round easily. You know, it's really catchy. Um, the vocals, man. Adrian Freeman. I mean, he's going to be in this band, right? It's called Last In Line, which is my favourite Dio album, by the way. I know most people's is Holy Diver. They do come hand in hand. Me and the Iridiots were talking the other day about um, Dio and just a quick conversation at the end of one of our programmes about like the best Dio, the Dio album, you know, and it's always out of the first two in it. Most people, are, it's Last In Line or Holy Diver. And they're fucking close. They are almost like neck and neck but um i just for me last in line just edged it it always has it always it's always edged it since i was a kid listening to that album um but i love both obviously and getting back on subject so andrew freeman's in a band with vinnie apice and vivian campbell right um for starters obviously in that classic lineup of do it's called last in line do is my favorite vocalist ever right he always will be i think what a fucking is known as the for most people you know in a classic metal he's known as the best vocalist ever isn't he i mean you asked you ask vocalists who the best vocalist is a lot of them big majority of them say dio um so you know even though it's not i know they've played a couple of dio songs i saw them live as well at download and they were excellent i played straight through the heart which was excellent um to have that on your shoulders a little bit because you're going to get compared, aren't you? If you're in bands with these guys, in a band with these guys and you're called Last In Line, you do a bit of Dio stuff as well. Man, he's got a lot to live up to and fuck me, he sounds... There's so much power and soul in his voice. Control, power and soul all in, wrapped in one. Just love his vocals, man. I think he's fucking brilliant. I really do. Um... You know, this reminds me a little bit of, of as well because of the bluesy side, but a little bit of like Inglorious, the band, British band Inglorious, who were a great band, by the way. Um, almost reminds me of that sort of stuff. Maybe a little bit heavier, maybe, but they do some heavier stuff as well. But it's got that sort of bluesy, classic rock feel that Inglorious have got. Um, but man, this fucking... Oh, I love this. I love this song. It's really catchy. And mainly, it's got that groove. So much groove to it. Let's listen to the rest. Hopefully Vivian will uh, give us a solo. Here we go.
Been long classic fade out there. Took about 20 seconds to fade out, but man, absolutely loved it. Love Vivian's guitar work on that. You know what, he's got that real cool, I love the way he does that dampened string thing, you know, when he does his on his guitar. He done, done a little bit of that in that solo. Um, just fucking great, man. Just really classic rock, bit of blues, bit of blues to it, but heavy at the same time. Just musicians on top of their game, showing you how, showing the old youngsters how it's done, without a doubt. <laughs> Absolutely loved it, man. That was brilliant. Um, let me know, guys, what you think of this second single from Last In Line. It's called Do The Work. It's from the album Jericho on Ear Music. Great label, that, by the way. Some great music coming out on Ear Music. It's their third album. It's out on the 31st of March. Let me know, guys, in the comments below if you like it. And I'll see you soon.